Okay, hello and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. Okay. <laughs> Much as I'd love to stay here and finish looting this apartment, I've got to get home. I'm not even gonna wait until daytime. <laughs> uh, what the hell, I only got a half hour. Oh, uh, we don't have any, oh yeah we do. Yep. Don't care. <laughs> and there's the morning bell. I was thinking about this overnight. I do think about this game overnight. And, uh... <laughs> Okay. That occurred to me. This game would be every bit as good, and they wouldn't have to change a whole lot if they made this about mutants. And it would make a lot more sense. Uh, somebody mentioned in the comments the other day, you know, like, how could zombies possibly see or hear? Because, you know, the little blood vessels that are required for sight and sound and all that. Man, this thing... Ugh. And I was thinking... Yeah, you know, there's a lot of problems with zombies. Not just... I mean, you know, not just the fact that dead people are walking around and, well, let's face it, if they were still capable of walking around, they wouldn't be dead. And, you know, so this whole... I don't know. It would just solve a lot of problems if they said, okay, these are mutants. That's why one of them can puke. That's why one of them crawls around and screams a lot. And, you know, that's why all of this stuff is... They used to be people, and then they got infected with this weird, freaky mutation. Oh, I love these trees. And plus, that way it wouldn't be, you know, this is just another zombie survival game. And no, man, this is mutant survival. Plus, that would give them a lot more, uh... uh a lot more imagination and, uh... Like when, when they first introduced the new, uh, the, the burnt survivor, everybody was complaining. You know, he doesn't look right, he doesn't, why would he be able to do this? And Hmm. Okay, so let's try this. First of all, let's get some inventory going here. 
Uh, metal goes up here. Cloth, ours. Okay. And then ammunition. And gun parts. Yeah, so I got my first sniper pirate. Sniper rifle part, and I found the book for the, uh, hey, what do you know? It's got a 600 barrel. Alright. Anyway, um, what I was saying. Oh yeah, the hide goes up here. You better hide! Alright, just stop saying that. Alright, so all the food's over here. Yeah, so it would, uh... Man, I'm just, like, all over the place now. I <laughs> have no idea what I'm talking about. And so... Alright. Grain alcohol and recipes. Gas can. Just one. And I get a hundred gas cans for that. Okay. Alright. Now... Let's grab a chunk of this. Come down here. Gas can. Ten. And then we get a thousand gas cans for that. Okay. I think the shale oil is definitely the better way to go. Let's let's make some bottled water. Oh. Put them beakers away. Alright, so I put the pistol ammo away. Might as well put the pistol away. How much gas? We don't have any gas down here. All our gas is up there. Okay. 51 duct tape, cloth, oil. Oh. Oh, well. If that's the case. Ah, not quite. Um. Let's go with one hundred. And then how much of this? That'll do. So we ran out of uh, cloth, huh? Okay. That's not what I expected. Actually, you know what? Hold up. Ah. Uh. Let's put the lead in first. And then we'll add some more clay over here. And what are you doing? You just need... get all of this and this
I was going to make new tools, but I figured, nah, I'll save that for later. All forges blazing. Well, hell, let's just... Seventy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now we're making some gas. Alright, so we still got plenty of corn. What are you doing over here? And let's... But we've only got four grain alcohol left. Hmm. Not enough. We need six. So let's get some more grain alcohol going. What do we need for grain alcohol? Cornmeal. Do I have cornmeal? I do not. What else do we need? Cornmeal and bottled water. We've got plenty of bottled water, so let's... Go ahead and do this. Get. Thank you. 28 potatoes. First of all, let's make, uh... Oh. Let's make as much stew as we can. There you go. Alright, so I guess I used up all the potatoes. Good. Excellent, excellent. Oh yeah, this is... That's only going to be another minute. Okay. Let's see what we got going on down here. I haven't found anything here. Kind of disappointed by that. I wonder if I should, uh... Oh, it's her again. Yeah, I should go up there and grab the mini bike and just go for it. But Oh, 
Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Oh, cobblestone. Yeah. We need uh, some scrap metal there. Okay. Well, that's enough working around the house. Uh, let's put this back. Put this up here. Sorry, put this here. Uh, what do we got? Do we need anything else? Uh, let's put this bottled water back. Uh, okay. <coughs> Everything looks good. Uh, we got gas. We got... Let's put this wood back. I'm going to put this green alcohol away because we don't need that anymore. For this, at least. <coughs> honey. Yeah, we got way too much honey, but what the heck. Where am I putting? Am I putting honey in here? Yes. Alright, we got food, medicine, drink, health kit. Let's go upstairs. Oh, look, look at that. I didn't see that anywhere. Oh, there it is. I love that. I'm just gonna run. around these cacti. Wow, look at that. Okay, let's go... Let's go here. That way I can do it this way. Wow. Put 
put that in there. There. Alright. Alright, let's go take a look at this. I was going to be really pissed if it had the gas can book in it. Someone said that. It's like every book, uh, every bookcase I look in from now on is going to have a gas can book in it. Just that one book, and suddenly I've got more gas than I know what to do with. What? Okay, so there's a mine down here, but we haven't really gone all that north. We haven't really gone all, I mean, we've gone a lot to the south, actually. Oh, there we are. Swim in through the desert. Yeah, so this is why I wanted that book so bad. It's like, now that I got the book... This goes straight north. <laughs> Hit a rock. Stop dead. Love it. Yeah, now that I got the stupid gas book... The whole map is opened up. I can actually get somewhere. Okay. I'm just checking. I actually do have... <laughs> crossbow bolts on me. I didn't know if I had any... If I put my crossbow bolts away or not. You know what I should do, though? I should go over here. Ah, there we are. And get all the stuff that I left there. Which is... Mostly just a bunch of, uh, um, biofuel. Yeah, they made... I mean, having a mini bike is almost a necessity in this game now. And of course, it's great fun. Oh, I left the door open. Huh. What's down here? Anything? Oh, an anvil. And stone. Okay. 
nothing I need there. Cooking grill and a beaker. Okay. And some wood frames. Good. Oh, wait. Crud. Oh yeah, these car batteries will come in handy. I really, I don't, I don't think I need these stones, honestly. I can leave those here. That's an old pickaxe, grass. Oh, we'll take the plant. Nope, won't. That's it. Let's go. Let's close the door this time. Yeah, I suppose if you had the loot respawn set for like three days or something, I don't know, a week, something less than 30 days, then it might be okay to like stay in one place and... I mean, you've got pretty much everything in the city, so... can't do that with parts. Oh, is that, huh? Okay. Yeah, so, I mean, it's not like you're going to find anything really wonderful wandering around. It's just like... Oh, look, another born and noble. Oh, boy, you know... Damn it, left the door open again. If I just... She summoned a horde on me. You think so? Up. Let me get out of your way from here a second. Okay. I had to turn my timer off.
Oh man. <coughs> Sorry. I have to get some stamina back. Quit shooting at me. <laughs> Damn it. Buddy, fancy meeting you here. Back off. Why are you crawling? Okay. Who's left? Is that everybody? That was a pretty eventful and fun day. Let's see what we got. Okay, let's put these away. Bing, bang. Deal with that later. Oh yeah. This. Got some nine millimeter shells, that's fine. What have you got going? Okay. Biofuel. Wow, we can't take any more gas. Alright. So empty jars. Don't go in that one. Sorry. There. Alright, this and this. 
leather, glue, put the case up here, and this. Seriously? I mean, we literally just ended this. We literally just ended this. How often does that stupid thing come by? It hardly seems fair to me. Okay. That's enough gas on the bike. We're going to have to make some place down here to store it. I'm going to need another chest. Chest. There you go. And where are we going to put this one? Up here. That's good. I suppose it would make more sense. No, I'm not going to store the gas above my campfire. Next to the forge. Ah, uh, not such a great idea either. Uh, Alright, fine. For right now, let's store the gas. Okay. Oh, yeah. Let's clear out the dirt. Let's get rid of the wood, the gunpowder, and go here. Yeah, this was supposed to go there, I know. And this goes down here, and so does this. No. This goes up in here. That's it, huh? Let's put the rest of this up here. Keep the grain alcohol on me. Let's put let's put these batteries up here. Cause I can always make more stoplights out of them. More cement, damn you! All right, so you need clay. And I need to find more iron. <coughs> Get in there. Okay. Oh no, it's night time. Alright. that and that all right so i hope you enjoyed watching and i will see you next time